Hi, I'm Ed McWilliams, and I want to welcome you to the TC Body Bag training video. In the next few minutes, you will see how easy it is to achieve total containment of the odor and leaks associated with the transport and storage of human remains. We want you to start by removing the TC body bag from its wrapping. You will see an information placard which includes photo illustrated instructions for using the TC body bag. Unfold the six foot by nine foot bag and place it on the table with the textured side up. If the decedent is already on your workspace, lay the open bag over the decedent and unfold it. Next, find the perforations located 12 inches in from each side and ensure that they will run parallel to the midline of the decedent. If working over the decedent, let one side of the bag hang down from your workspace while holding the other side. Fold the one side into the midline of the bag and then fold it again. Work the bag underneath the decedent until you can pull it free out from under to the other side of your workspace. The decedent should now be laying on top of the middle of the open bag. Starting at one corner, begin separating the textured liner from the bag. We have found that peeling up one inch across the 12 inches until the perforation is found and then pulling the perforation straight up works best. While separating the layers and locating the perforation line, your separation should meet the perforation line and begin pulling the liner parallel to the midline in an upward motion. Separate the liner from the bag on each side of the decedent. At the head and the foot, separate the liner and pull toward the decedent. This should give you about six to eight inches at the head end of the bag and the foot end of the bag where the adhesive is exposed. Fold the liner under the head and the foot if desired. Pull one side of the TC bag up and over the decedent. Use one hand to stabilize the bag while you fold the bag's edge over itself to expose the adhesive upwards of the midline. Place the ID tag on the exposed adhesive and press to stick. Next, pull the opposite side of the bag up and over the decedent and let it fall to cover the exposed adhesive at the midline. Lightly press the bag together at the seam to create a seal using no electricity or special tools. Press the bag together securely at the head, then roll the bag towards the decedent. This will ensure total containment of odors and fluids, as well as create handles for easy lifting. Repeat this procedure at the foot. Press the plastic layers together, roll them up. Some special features of this new product are, if you wish to open the bag to perform a small procedure, simply slice the bag open, do the work you intend to do, and when you're finished, pinch the bag back together to reseal it. Second, the bag is transparent to facilitate the easy identification of the decedent without having to open the bag. Three, to transfer the bag from place to place, simply grip the sides and lift. The bag will not tear. And four, the design of this bag is constructed to permit direct cremation. We hope this has been helpful to you and makes the process easier for you to understand. Thank you very much.